I'm Kelly Spencer, I'm the research manager here at RUH. We're really proud to be a really research active hospital and we always take part in lots of different research trials to help improve treatments and outcomes for all of our patients. Recently, since the coronavirus pandemic, we've been concentrating on research into COVID and how we can help support finding better treatments for patients infected with this disease. We're proud to be taking part in a number of international and national research studies. Our research nurses spend a lot of time going up to the wards, to ITU and the other departments where the COVID patients are to explain to them about these studies, talk to them about whether or not they want to be involved and then to take consent from them to say that they are happy to be in these studies and that they're happy for their data to be used and shared. Okay, so we just came up to the intensive care unit. Um, we coming to have a look to see if there's any eligible patients for the recovery trial. We can see there's a patient in the side room 10, so we're going in to um, have a look on, on his notes, on his medical notes to see if he's eligible for the trial. So obviously for this we'll need to be in full PPE, so I'll go and change for some scrubs um, and we'll go and speak with the patient. We're just putting some PPE on because in a normal day and in research we probably wouldn't need to use all of this but now because of the outbreak even if we're only going to speak with a patient um, and approach for research we need to use full PPE. One of the big studies that we're taking part in is a huge international effort where we are collecting lots and lots of data on patients that are infected with COVID here at RUH. Um, and that data is being fed up to the Chief Medical Officer, Chris Whitty, and lots of the national groups that are looking at how we can better understand this disease. I think so far around 250,000 patients have been included in that study. Another important study that we're doing is called Recovery. That's looking at new treatments for patients with coronavirus. So treatments that are already used in other conditions, so antiviral drugs or drugs that help the immune system to better fight the disease. And we're looking to see whether or not those drugs are effective in helping patients to recover sooner or be discharged from hospital more quickly. I'm protected, so I'm going now and try to speak with the patient. Hello, Mr. Jones. I'm Lydia, one of the research nurses. Just coming to speak with you about the recovery trial that we're doing here in IUA. And we just uh, seen if um, some drugs are effective for the COVID viral infection. So all of these studies have been set up really quickly. The teams have worked really hard to make sure that we get these studies open and set up as soon as possible. It's really important that we understand whether or not any of these treatments will work. We're not expecting to find a cure, but we do hope that these treatments will help patients to recover more quickly from coronavirus or reduce their stay in hospital.